Terry, I sure do appreciate you inviting me out here to, to uh, hunt on your ranch here. It's, uh, it's, it's been a great, great uh, opportunity for me. I uh, found out once I got out here that you own a processing plant too and uh, you have a lot of the animals out here processed at your place. Yes sir, we do. Uh, in my facility we've got a big commercial unit. Of course it's not portable and uh, pretty interested about this. This is uh, pretty convenient, real portable and uh, I'd like to see what I want to do. Well these are a couple new units that uh, my company's just come out with and they're designed exclusively for the, uh, the, the outdoorsman if you will. It's their heavier duty models than uh, and some of the kitchen models that, uh, that we do on our houseware side of our business. And when I say uh, exclusive to the outdoorsman, they're made uh, for repetitive sealing. They have uh, heavy duty uh, commercial grade uh, motors within. And uh, these have actually uh, got built in uh, a place to put uh, storage for your rolls. <laughs> uh, for liquid pull, you have a little tray there so you don't get liquid pulled into the motor. Uh, heavy duty sealing bars, but uh, but this is a pretty, uh, pretty neat little operation with this uh, brand new uh, item that we've got. You can actually use it as 12 volt, which I'll, I'll show you how to use here. Okay, yeah, makes you see that. This is a very cool machine. Why don't you go ahead and fire the truck up here so we can, uh, we can show how this 12 volt works. And uh, we've got a 20 foot long cord, as you can see here. Runs all the way from the cigarette lighter, plugs into the back of the machine here. Let me show you how this is gonna work. Where we basically make a bag at this point in time. You make it any any length you want, so we'll just pull out our bag material. I'm going to lock it down, and to make a bag we're going to just hit seal at this point. So we've got a little red light on there, and as soon as the red light's off we're going to know that the bag is made. And then what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're going to cut it off, and we've got a bag made at this point in time. As you can see we've got a, a nice big seal across huh. here. So the bag is made. Now that's convenient. That is convenient. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to take some sausage here that I just had made up. I'll show, to show you how it works, I'm going to take it out of my other bag and throw it into the new bag. I'm going to lay this halfway into the vacuum chamber like so. Push the lid down, lock it, and then as you can see it's got a vacuum seal on it. It's got a sensor built into the machine itself and it knows when all of the air is extracted. Once all the air is extracted, it automatically turns it off and it does the whole process for you, which is very cool. See, it's taken out all the air. Air is actually what the cause is of, uh, of when your meat gets spoiled in, the, in your ice box with the freezer burn. So once all the air is out, you have no, uh, no chance of that happening. So this means lasts you up to five years. Once it's done, you just open the lid got it made there. It's a slick little process. Like I was saying a while ago, I've got a commercial unit in my processing facility, and that actually cycled as quick or quicker than my commercial model did. That's, that's great. I'm impressed. Think about that. Very, very impressed. That is cool. Now, now this is actually the only machine that we've got that can use be used in the outdoors as 12 volt. We've got another machine we've just come out with here. Got a little bit of the mossy oak camo uh, appeal to it, which is very cool. If the wife doesn't like it sitting on the counter with the uh, the camo, it's actually got a flip up to it that it can just sit straight up on the counter and all you've got is the black. Huh. That's, a, that's a very cool unit too. Pretty convenient. Yep. Hey, you think you know how to use this thing? I do, I believe I can handle it. Let's go get some meat. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs>